All right, uh, thinking of beer, chances are you don't think of the Arizona Science Center. But that might change after this weekend. Heidi has more on a unique event happening there, and it could make for a perfect date night. Yeah, good morning. How would you like to have a date night and you can sample 10 of the best local beers in town? And where are you going to do it? Of all places, the Arizona Science Center. Uh, it's all part of this ancient Egypt exhibit that they've had going on for quite a while. But Saturday night, they're kind of kicking things up a notch and they're adding this wonderful adult only event. This is Emily. Tell me why you guys are doing this. How does beer tie into ancient Egypt? Absolutely. So, Egyptian, the old Egyptian civilization was one of the first to document the beer making process. Uh, women. Uh, as part of their society role were the beer makers and the brewers. So. Interesting. I love that. Absolutely. So we'll have some lectures that evening to talk a little more on the topic. And as you had mentioned, several local Arizona craft breweries will be on site sampling their product as well. And we talk about this a lot because craft breweries here in the Valley specifically have just become so popular in recent years. Walk with me as we look at some of the costumes because uh, you guys are going to have, you're really giving this some flavor out for, for that night, but just like the costume I'm in right now. Yeah, absolutely. It's really fun. Easily, Fun Shop in Phoenix has um, been a part of the night, so we've got our staff in costume that evening. You're giving it some real authenticity. I want to talk to the folks from North Mountain Brewery. You're one of the breweries who will be represented that night. And you guys are actually making a beer specifically for this event. What's this brew going to taste like? Uh, it's going to be kind of. It's going to be an, an unusual beer. We've got a lot of ingredients that aren't typically in beer: cumin, coriander. Uh, toasted Sesame Street, honey, dates, cinnamon. Did you have to research kind of back what they were using back in these times to make this, or how did you come up with this? Well, I did a bunch of research, which it's a little difficult because everybody has different opinions. Nobody really knows. So is this in it? Is that in it? It, it was both a, a pain and a blessing because in the end we could kind of do whatever we wanted and who's going to say we're wrong. Right. Nobody really has relatives probably back that far. They're not going to question you on this. So you can taste 10 different local beers out here Saturday night, uh, but also some fun foods too. We've talked about these guys before, the mustache pretzel uh, food truck. How did you guys get involved with this? Well, uh, we actually had the opportunity to uh, to serve some of the folks here at Westworld at the last you know beer event that we did. And uh, other than feeling a little bit underdressed at the moment, we're very excited to be I am a this. goddess today, you know. Well, yes, of course. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're very excited to be here. And right here we have our Parmesan garlic and cinnamon sugar mustache pretzels. All right, so it's a fun event. Again, adults only because uh, it is a beer tasting. Tickets are still available. And I want you to talk about how much the tickets are. And there's a special deal going on right now on Living Social. Tell me about that. Yes. The general public tickets are available on azscience.org for $50. Living Social price will be $29, and that's available at livingsocial.com. So a pretty good deal. You get to do 10 different samplings of beer, plus just have a good time at this ancient Egypt exhibit. It's all happening out at the Arizona Science Center, and of course, as we always do, we'll put more information for you on our website at azfamily.com. Back to you.